Well, it's Zone Television Tour Night again, the Emporium Extravaganza, one of our Perry Clubs we hit uh, once every two months. Tonight on the decks, John and the Please Women, Lisa Pinup, Stretch and Vern, myself, Nick Corelli, JFK and all the residents as well. Well, it looks as if it's shaping up to be a bit of a hot night tonight. We're going to take a look inside the club and see what is happening. Well, we've got an exclusive for you on the zone. We've managed to grab Lisa Pinup from a busy, busy schedule. How are you doing, Lisa? Fine, thank you. Now, you just come back from my beach. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, well, first night in New York, I was in BCMs, and I flew over the next night to Miss Money Pennies at El Divino. Really, really good night. Really enjoyed it. Then flew back from your busy weekend again to carry it all back on again. Now, what do you think of Passion? You're quite a regular at the club. Oh, I love it. It's one of my favourite clubs. It's fantastic. It's, everyone here is always up for party. Even if you play the first set, as soon as you put your first record on, the dance floor is just like, oh, it's brilliant. So definitely a thumbs up for you, if you're planning to not been down to a, a new club. Definitely recommend Passion, definitely. Okay. Now, I've heard along the grapevine you're releasing a new record soon. Tell us a little bit more about that. That's right, it's called Feel the Poison. It's out on white label. should hit the shops about four or five weeks' time, hopefully, if all goes well. And you're going to be giving, giving a few promos out to some of the top DJs? Well, I've, I've got me test pressings. I'll be going out to them shortly. So you keep us uh, posted on what's going on with the record? Yeah, definitely. And uh, tell us about your future dates and where you're going to be playing. Oh, all over the country. I mean, I'm resident of Freedom Bagley, so I always end up there every weekend, five to seven. Other than that, I'm all around the country. Uh, and for the viewers in the Midlands, they can see you at Money Pennies quite regularly? Yeah, I play Money Pennies every two to three months. Cool. And now uh, your big tunes for at the moment, what, what's doing it large for you? Oh, too many to mention. Too, too many, many to mention. Yeah. Every day it changes. <laughs> you have to stay tuned to the zone to listen out to what Lisa's playing. <laughs> Lisa, thanks very much for joining us on The Zone. Thank you. Uh, and enjoy the night. Cheers. <laughs> Three of the maddest DJs in the whole wide world, Mr. Stretch and Vern and JFK. How are you doing, Stretch? I'm very well, how are you? And Mr. Vern? I'm very well, sir. And Mr. JFK? Good evening, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. What, what a mad night. It's fantastic out there, absolutely fantastic. The atmosphere's rocking, that's because I've been on a little bit later. These two gentlemen are going to be on a little bit later on, and it's going to be, yes! Now, it's the third time the zone's been down here, and obviously tonight it's going to be the best night. I think so. I think the atmosphere is going to be so good that when they get more young head on a little bit later on, we're going to empty his room and they'll all be in the front. Yeah. Cheers, Shay. Cheers, Shay. <laughs> now, have you seen the two mad cows out in the main room? Uh, no, who are they? There's a lot of mad cows the, I've seen on the way in. <laughs> the two mad cows that used to come about six months ago. No, what they what well, They're split in half now. They're carrying baby cows. Really? Yeah, they've got them in the little pockets emptying out everyone. Couple of calves. Couple of calves. Yeah, like. couple of calves. Couple of calves. Now, Stretch, tell us about passion. Um, you just, what do you want to know about? Sum it up in two words. Um, awesome, very. 
the other way around. <laughs> well, I just want to say, if you think it's mental in here, you should get down the chinky down the rug. So I've just driven past it, mate, and it is rocking out. Is it, is it busy outside? Oh, mate, I think it's like there, new consignment of curry sauce has just landed. and really? it's, oh, it's kicking off <laughs> frenzy, mate. Right? As you can see, I've had some of the old spots on the forehead are up, so... Uh, we, we, we had that. That's Now, you guys are no strangers to the Emporium at Passion. Tell us about the lunch you've had down here. Oh, uh, always wicked, best. mate. Always wicked. Besides, stretches had one unfortunate one, which we're not going to go into. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, no, we're not. We're not. We're not no. <laughs> <laughs> For legal reasons, that's go that's going to be published in our new book, The Life and Times of uh, S and V. But uh, no, it's always good. JFK gives us too much baby sham, and uh, published when I'm dead as well. Yeah. Now you just come back from my B for a man mission. Tell us about that. Crazy, absolutely crazy. Twelve thousand people jumping up, going mad. Absolutely awesome. Sex on stage as well, and that was just Vern. <laughs> that was just behind the deck. They just came to see my butox, and uh, I didn't let them down, let's say. Unfortunately, you opened them a bit too wide. <laughs> <laughs> now, Jason, tell us about the passion itself. The night is absolutely kicking out there. Well, you've been down here three times now, so you know roughly the score. But we're going from strength to strength. We've just taken the ceiling up in the main room 12 foot. We've uh, redesigned all the flyers, as you can see behind. We've got our, our brand new logo that's uh, going to be dominating the whole world in the next six months, doing some merchandising, doing some more parties. Don't forget August, Sunday, August the 30th, we've got JFK's Bank Holiday Birthday Bash, okay? That's gonna be down here. That's on a Sunday night. It's the first ever Sunday event down at the Emporium. And that will be rocking. Just the residents, five pounds to get in, but it will be really cool. Let's talk about your new record anyway. Let's talk about me, yeah. Um, the next record is called Michel Lambert, and it's about, it's a French filtered little thing that we've done, and it is uh, rocking. And you're gonna be hearing all about it pretty soon. And uh, JFK's been keeping it quiet, anything about his record? Uh, yeah, not surprised you heard it. <laughs> Jason, <laughs> tell, tell us some more about that. Uh, I've just finished doing uh, some production with Arcane and uh, they're on Deconstruction Records and we've just uh, done a new track called The Elected. So hopefully you'll be hearing that very soon. Quite a progressive, groovy sort of thing. A bit like El Nino, that sort of groove that we're into at the moment. I think it's a bit like Elvis then, mate. Elvis, yeah. yeah. Oh, well, bless my soul. Well, he What's looks wrong like with me? He's sounding like it's, him. Him. <laughs> it's all getting a bit out of hand there. I'm going to let you guys get back to the deck to speak. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! And I'm Sabrina. And you're watching The Zone.
I'm in the corridor of passion. I've managed to grab two giggly little girls <laughs> off the dance floor. The two Jays, Jody and Joe. Hello. Hey. How are you? I'm fine. Are you having a good night? Yeah, bro. Yeah. yeah. And are you looking forward to hearing Alex P? Uh, yeah, very much. <laughs> you, look, you look slightly worn out. Have you uh, been dancing the night away? Yeah, I'm knackered. Yeah? Yeah. And uh, tell us what you think of passion. <laughs> Brilliant. She's dying not to swear, isn't she? Now, you may think we're in a Doctor Who set, but we're not really. Hello. How are you doing? Not too bad. Are you hot in there? Very. Very, very, very. Have you not been out on the floor yet? Yeah, just, just finished. Just finished, yeah. yeah. Just, just come in. Now, I've never seen you two guys down here before. Uh, we started, when did we start? Well, yeah, it'd be a while ago, but we haven't really had these suits for long, so... And, uh, do, you, do you go around to different clubs and do this? Or? No, just a passion. Just a passion? Yeah. So they're really honoured to have you down here, aren't they? Yeah. They are indeed. Now, where can we expect to see you dancing a little bit later? Uh, we'll be on the top podium, right at the front of the uh, dance floor, uh, on the hour, every hour. Hello. Well, this is a bit of a rare opportunity. I've managed to, uh, to get hold of our producer, Mr. Alan Warner, of The Zone. Yes. Alan. Hi. You're looking a little bit more relaxed than usual. Not normally, no. You've lost the camera, but you've still got the belt. I have, yes. Can't you see? Uh, are you enjoying yourself tonight? I am, I am, I am. Nick Carelli's lifting the roof off in the back. He is. And, uh, and so were you. I was there. Thanks yes. very much. And uh, John Kelly's in the main room now doing his business. He is. That's right. And we're waiting for Alex P. Alex P's on the way. I don't know which car he's going to come in. 130, 130. Yeah, well, he's got five Ferraris. Which one do you reckon he'll come in tonight? Porsche. The Porsche. Uh, maybe, maybe he's bought one. Uh, never know. It might be his Mini. Well, Alan, I'm going to let you go and dance in the club. It could even be his push bike. Just keep watching the zone for more mad antics. That's all I've got.
and welcome to the last of the zone tours. And we're here in the plush surroundings of the kitchen. Can you just have a look at this? I'll tell you what, we get all the best places here, don't we? We do indeed, but I do like this one. It's almost as good as that. You take me to the Rip, the Plaza, no, and now the kitchen at the Passion Emporium. I've got to do the dishes. What? I've got to do the dishes. Go on then, come with it. You need to rub the gloves on first, and I'll just put them on. <laughs> about time you started playing, isn't it, really? Uh, yeah, about five minutes. Do you use your pastime hobby, playing with the, uh, the 12, 12 inch ladies stroke, stroke whatever, whatever comes next? <laughs> They're by a beer all up! This is the part of the club we don't often get to see, isn't it? No, it's right. Is this backstage? It's just the backstage, yeah. <laughs> Let's get down there and see exactly what's going on. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> <laughs> Victims tonight, it's Dave, visual supervisor down here at Passion. Hello. Now, in three visits we've been down here, we've managed to avoid you. Mm, but not yeah. tonight. No, not tonight. It's a bit special tonight down there, isn't it? Really busy. Um, yeah, we've got a, a packed house in there, surprisingly. And, uh, Farley's introduction was uh, a little bit out of the ordinary, wasn't it? Yeah, just a little. Um, not a lot to say, really. I thought the hymn book was going to come out as well. It could have done. It could have done. Now, uh, tell the viewers some of the nights you've had down at Passion, some of the ones that stick in your mind. Um, right. Boxing Day, which will be hopefully will be a repeat this year with Boxing Day. Um, I don't know. You've been here on some of the good nights. I have, yeah, but you've been on more than me. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm here every week. Um, nearly every Saturday, really. Now, since you've been working, who would you say is blowing the roof off? Um, apart from uh, good old Jason, we've got um, Sam Fontaine, Todd Paul. They usually rock it a bit. David, rest his soul. Um, a lot of the big names tend to rock it a lot. And any up and coming DJs, because there's people always looking out for new names, any ones that you, you notice on your travels? Um, Nick Corelli, yourself. <laughs> He's very flattering this guy, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> He's in the background then, Nick is. <laughs> um, it, well, there's not a lot of real up and comings here, but out of yourselves, just like Nick, yourself. Um, that'd be it. Okay. Mm. Have a good night. I will. And you. Well, we can't see you underneath these. Uh, it must get pretty hot in there. Yes, it does. Yeah? <laughs> you, you having a good time tonight? We yeah, are. It's very good tonight. Uh, some of your costumes you, you normally wear down here, people can expect you to see in. Uh, yeah, this is one of our most regular. Yeah, you, you don't. Them well. One of our favourites. Yeah? Any night, any night, particular night that sticks in your head you've had since you've been working here? Uh, probably Jason's birthday bash. Yeah. yeah. Did he save you any cake? That's what we want to know. No, she made, made it. it. <laughs> <laughs> you made it? I made him with the cake. <laughs> Fantastic. Now then, now then, you are watching The Zone Television and I am Mrs JFK. Hello. And you are... Nick Corelli. <laughs> now then, now then, as it happens, jingle jangle jewellery. <laughs>
coming up on the zone, something a little bit special himself, the man, Farley Jack Master Funk. I am himself, the man. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having on me. On the zone? Yes. It's been a, me in. been a good one tonight. Yeah, definitely. Uh, some guys at HMV made a very uh, uh, easy night for me. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> no, the crowd's been absolutely phenomenal. Yeah, I think so. Uh, this is the best club for me in England. I enjoy this club more than any club. And I'm not just saying that either. It, it's actually true. You won't see it on two interviews. This is actually my favorite club of all in England. A lot of DJs do say that, but it doesn't actually get the media hype that a lot of other clubs do. But I think next year this is going to be the biggest club in the UK. Well, you know, if media hype is going to take away from the fact that this is the best yeah. club, then don't do it because oversaturation sometimes kills clubs. Uh, this club is uh, not on a map, uh, so to speak, where people know of it, but the people who live here, they really come out and have a good time. So if that means keeping it underground, then they should do that because a lot of clubs like Ministry, it used to be underground and wanted recognition, and now it's, it's so oversaturated with uh, people who come from all over the country till they can't even get a vibe going in the club anymore. Okay, what's the scene like in the States in the moment? Absolutely phenomenal. Uh, I play you know, there as well as here, so it's great. Cool. And there's a lot of U.S. producers as well filtering into England more and more. Yeah, well, you know, our music is biggest over in this country because uh, we don't really make pop records that go to, like, pop radio. We really like underground producers. So even at this stage of the game, for me, going on 19 years, telling my age, I know I don't look it. That's okay. Compliment uh, myself. Just that hand on my back. You, 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 look, you look good. You look pretty good. Oh, thank you. Yeah. See, that's twice. It's two <laughs> in one interview. That's all right. 60 seconds. Now, uh, the Van Helden record is doing it really big at the moment. Yeah, you know, you sold me that record today, and I didn't even get a chance to play it. Didn't you? No. Sorry, mm. Van Helden, but I like your record. Now, studio projects from yourself, any coming up in the future? Um, man, I got about five albums of material done. So uh, you'll be selling some of my stuff again very soon. Now, there is a compilation album just out at the moment, isn't there? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, CD, yeah, yeah, CD, mix CD, yeah, Gospel House. It's, uh, everything I do now is Spiritual House, you know, for awareness of, uh, you know, Jesus being in my life, of course. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, when can we next expect you to see you over in England again? Next week. Next week. Where are you going to be playing? That's a good question. You don't know? No diary? No. When I, when I get here, I land at Heathrow, jump in a car, and start driving, you know. I do this to everyone. Everyone I meet, I always ask them where they're playing, and they never know where they're going to play. Well, I'm going to be in <laughs> Jerusalem, and I'm going to be, man, I'm, I'm everywhere. You know, it's kind of hard to remember, you know, the schedule, because when I get off the plane, then I'm playing there. And, you know, wherever I am, I'm just about got a case of records with me. So, Passion, definitely the club for the future for 1999? It's actually now. Now, definitely now. Now, yeah. Right now. On the map. If, On the map. If you've not been down here, you've got you get yourself down to this club. Get yourself down to Colville and get a dose of JFK. He's the man here. Believe. Yeah, you heard it right here from the man in Farley, Jack Master Funk, live and exclusively on the zone. And me and JFK are going to do a tune together. Are you? Yeah. That, that's, that's another bit of new news. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Me and JFK officially are going to do a song together. So it's JMF and JFK. Does Jason know about this? Of course he does. does he? You're not surprising him. No, I, I actually pulled him on the way in the door and said we must work together. I can't, I can't wait to hear more of that. I'm sure you're going to let us play it on the program when you oh, get Oh, yeah, we're going to let you sell it too. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, I'm going to be seeing you in Miami in March. We're oh, going to be right. there again. I'll be there if, uh, I don't know how they come up with new hurricane names, but maybe Hurricane Susan might be there or uh, Jerry or something. <laughs> but I plan on going, you know, if George doesn't show back up, you know. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Thanks very much for joining us, Farley, on the, on the zone, me, and have a safe journey back to the States.
Welcome to the zone. Are you having a good night? Yeah, we certainly are. Excellent. How about yourself? Absolutely banging. Brilliant. Did you come here most weeks? Uh, yeah, we travelled about a bit. We were a bit mashed today from uh, God's Kitchen last night. Oh, were you up there last night? Uh, yeah. We certainly were, yeah. Who was on last night then? Uh, Jizz Jules, uh, Sonny, John <laughs> Kelly, <laughs> Jeremy Ely. <laughs> it was a bit of a, a small good one. Night. Bit of a small line up yeah. here, yeah. yeah. What do you think's passion then? We love it. We absolutely <laughs> love it. Yeah. <laughs> um, tell me the best thing about the Emporium. Just the atmosphere, the people here, absolutely incredible. They're all up for it. Go for it all night long. And uh, who's your favourite DJ? JFK. Oh, oh, okay. Who's your favourite DJ? Scott Bond. Thank you, but a bit of variance to the show, that's what we like to see. The tune you can hear in the background is obviously Mr Nick Corelli playing. It is indeed. And what a god he is too, we love ya. We love ya. More corridor madness right here on the zone, in the corridor of passion. We're going to go and grab some mad people, aren't we? Everyone argues and fights and everyone's split up with their boyfriend, but we're going to find out exactly uh, who's splitting up with who. Come on, follow us. The sad old love stories continue. Oh, isn't it lovely? Hello, ladies. We're recording for The Zone, a club television programme. How are you doing? Fine, thank you. You having a good night tonight? Yeah, brilliant. Yeah, yeah? yeah fantastic. What do you think of Fire Jam Master Funk, then? Brilliant. Yeah, he's doing yeah. it well. Yeah, he's doing well. Do you come down there quite often? Sometimes. What are your plans for New Year's Eve? Uh, um, I don't know yet. No, you haven't made up your mind yet? No. no. Nah. Do you think of the DJ? Spot on. No, we like him. Like, we want to see more Judge Jules down here. Do we? Yeah, we do. Why? Because he's spot on. What about Jack Master Funk? Do you like him? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. He's, he's spun some good records. Like, he's... Now, let me ask you a question. What do you what do you think about Nick Corelli? Nick Corelli? Uh, no, pass. No, pass. You don't like him? Pass. Oh, all right. Well, I've heard he's a bit of the one with the ladies, so uh, rumour has it. Oh, Have a good night. Sorry? Have a good night. I oh, will do. Thank you. Pardon? What? It's all getting a bit too noisy down here in the corridor. I managed to grab Sarah, one of our last uh, customers of tonight. You having a good night tonight, Sarah? Oh, it's been brilliant. The atmosphere's the best ever. I mean, everyone's dead happy. The music's been brilliant. And what do you think of Farley? Farley? I've only seen him once, like, it's the first time I've seen it. It's excellent. We haven't seen anyone dancing here as much as that tonight. It's been brilliant. Really, really busy, isn't it, tonight? Very busy. I can imagine there's about 3,000 people here at the minute. You, you're not far wrong there. Are you a regular down the club? Do you come down there very often? Well, I travel here from Coventry, usually. Um, it's about half an hour drive, like, coming in a minibus or on the coach, but usually a big gang of us come every week. There's a lot of you here tonight coming down. 15 this week. 15. There's quite a lot of people to bring out. Brilliant night though. Like, make a night of it like every week. Every time we come it's excellent.